guys, Happy New Year and welcome back to Balto's Vlog. So for today, we will be talking about Kong Toys. When I first got Balto, I knew that we wanted to have some Kong Toys for him to enjoy. And it's pretty easy to use this. You just fill them up with your dog's kibbles. And there you go. You can actually use that as their Kong treat. You can also fill it up with some Kong snacks and in here you can see me using this Kong alternative <laughs> called Dogzilla Treat Pod. I got this from Hobbs and Lands. Actually, this is one of Balto's favorites. Sometimes he prefers this more than his regular Kong. And this is the easiest way to take their time and you know it really makes them fulfilled to work on their food. These enrichment toys are also very beneficial so that your dogs don't impulsively bite other things, destroy other things. It takes up their time and their energy so they will be more behaved in your homes. And I didn't want to confine myself in just giving him dry food in his Kong, so I like to be creative about it. Sometimes I put in treats like dehydrated poultry feet, I also put in some wet food, some liver spread, and his favorite, some sardines. Alright, so for this recipe, I'm going to be using Balto's favorite, the Kong bone. And this is easy because you just stuff a treat on each end. Normally, I put in some duck feet or chicken feet and a piece of sardines. <laughs> and he really loves this. <laughs> you like it? No? You like it, Bob? Yum. Yum. <laughs> this is like putting in kibbles in your regular Kong, but this one is in another shape and he likes these more natural treats. So we got Kong bone and duck feet. Already ate the chicken feet. <laughs> so there you see him munching on those duck feet, those chicken feet. And you know, that's a really good and satisfying ASMR session. Okay, so let's get on with the regular Kong for this recipe. I will be putting in some kibbles, some treats, meat treats like lamb and deer, and his favorite, liver spread. And of course, I top it off and seal it off with some poultry feet. So in here, I'm actually putting in some liver spread to top it off. I usually put in some loose dry kibbles at the bottom so it's easier for me to clean it. And then I put in some mixed wet food and dry food in the middle and top it off with something like a pate or a liver spread just to seal it off before I chuck in some chicken feet or duck feet and pop it in the freezer actually for about an hour or sometimes you can leave it overnight. And this can take your dog's time for about 30 minutes. I actually timed the ball tone in this session. You can actually watch his time-lapse video. <laughs>
Okay, so for this recipe, I will be using the Kong snack. So aside from using the chicken feet or duck feet, I like sealing my Kong toy off with the Kong snack. So this is like a huge piece of dry cable that you can just chuck at the end. So the rest of the things or the rest of the stuffing won't pour out. Other stuffings that you can use are yogurt, peanut butter, Balto likes liver spread, so I tend to use more of that. I tried also putting in some potato salad, but he didn't like it very much. He didn't really like the mayonnaise and stuff like that. He didn't really like veggies, or I haven't really uh, tried giving him much of veggies. But I noticed that he really loves eating meat and organ meat and to those um, kind of fillings. I tried giving him apples. He didn't like that as well. So you can be creative with your Kong recipe. You can follow a lot of Kong recipes online, but I tend to stick to the ones that Balto likes. So I noticed that he likes meat, organ meat, or poultry, fishes. So I tend to gravitate and buy those stuffings for him. So I guess that's all for today. Thank you so much for joining us. And if you have any other video suggestions for Balto, don't forget to leave them down through the comments. We'd love to hear what you think and we'll see you on our next video. Bye!